Okay, welcome back, and this is lesson two on Audacity and how to sample and make new beats in Audacity. So uh, let's get started. I'm going to play you then, uh, like we did last time, exactly what we're going to be looking at doing this lesson. It's going to end up sounding like this. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. That is, of course, Liam Neeson. I don't know what you want. I don't know who you are. So as you can see, I that's the first section we did. If you let my daughter go now, go now, go now. If you let my daughter go now. So this is what we're going to be doing, go slicing go now. the voice. If you let my daughter go now, go now, go now. If you let my daughter go now, then I will kill you. Okay, so you get the idea, right? Um, this all comes from a film uh, which Liam Neeson, Neeson is in, and if I just play you this, this is the whole track that you're going to have. You I don't know what you want. So I just took this off YouTube. You looking for a ransom, uh, got the MP3 of it, money. and what actually, you have? when you put the beat in, Now, this is useful on this side. This is the game. This is just going to make it louder. For people like you. If you let my daughter go now, that'll be the end of it. I will not look for you. I will not pursue you. But if you don't, I will look for you. I will find you. And I will kill you. Uh, and yeah, like I actually quite like it just with all of that over the beat. It sounds pretty interesting, but... Um, you know, it's not musical enough, so we're going to mix this up, make it a bit more uh, rhythmic. Okay, so how do to do that? Well, what I'm going to do is get rid of what I had here, uh, first of all, so it's completely blank. And I've just dragged this audio file in. It will be in the folder that you've got under Liam Neeson, I think. And like we did before, you can just drag that in, and it's going to end up looking like this, okay? So, I mean, a lot of this is the skills that we had in Lesson 1. What we're going to do is extract certain bits of it, so... I mean, we just listened through. I don't know who you are. I don't know who you are. That's a good one. So I'm going to highlight this, and I'm going to do the old trick of Option, Command, and I. And what's good about that is it automatically gives me a new track. Um, but we're going to do something a bit different on this one. So first of all, given that that's one of the bits that I want, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here to my Moving Tool, and I'm going to just move this back to the beginning, because this is going to be the first sample that I'm going to use. OK? Um, but now I'm going to go through, go back to my highlighter tool, and I'm just going to find, now I can, uh, if I mute this as well, this is probably going to stop getting in the way. That's good. Mute is really useful. As you can see, it grays out, and then I'm not going to hear it, so it allows me just to focus on what I've got here. So I don't know what you want. I don't know what you want. Right. I'm going to take that. So all I'm doing is just highlighting the bit of the voice that I want, but instead of removing it into a whole new track, all I'm going to do is go Command-C. That's Copy. And I'm going to go down onto this track, and I'm going to paste it anywhere into that track. Um, we can move them around later, right? But this is, for now, is just finding the bits I want to use. I don't know what you want. I don't know what you want. Uh, I'll take that as well. Highlight that. Copy. Go down here. And it doesn't matter at the moment where I'm putting it. I'm just taking the bits I want. If you were looking for a ransom. Nah. I'll tell you I don't have money. Money. I'm going to take money, because that's quite funny. I might want to use that. This will probably end up differently to the one I did before. I've done this a few times. It's different every time I do it because I have different ideas. That's the beauty of it. But what I do have are a very particular set of skills. Skills. I'm going to take skills as well. So I can... Of skills, of skills, of skills. Of skills, so I can bring this forward a little bit. Skills, 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 skills. Good. Copy. Put it down here. Paste. Where are we? Skills that make me a nightmare for people like you. Mm. If you let my daughter go now, that'll... If you let my daughter go now, I'll take that. Thank you very much. Copy. Down here. Paste. Uh, next bit. I will not look for you. I will not pursue you. No. But if you don't... But if you don't... I like that bit. Copy. Go down here. Paste that. I will look for you. Nope. I will find you. I will find you. 
copy that, paste it down there. Let's see. And I will kill you. Of course, the money bit, I will kill you. Copy that, put this down here. Okay, uh, that's all the bits I'm going to use. So for now, I guess, let's be brave. And I'm just going to get rid of that track because I want to make it nice and clean. Okay, so the reason we were looking up here and having the different sections is now that I'm going to think about this is um, this is eight bars, eight bars, and eight bars. So this is the structure. So whatever I have happening in here, I um, want to have little bits of repeat. So I'm going to use in this section here, I'm going to keep it simple and I'm just going to use these first two bits. I can unmute this now. So I'm just going to use these two samples here. I don't know who you are. I don't know what you want. Okay. And because I'm just going to use these two samples for this whole first eight bars. So what I want to do is give myself some room. So I'm going to highlight all of these samples I've got at the bottom for now. I'm going to go to move. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to move them out of the way if the computer will uh, catch up. And this now allows me some room here to work up to. I'm only going to be going up to here. Okay. And this is where I have to think musically right so I can already see I'm going to be sort of counting and listening to the beat in my head where do I actually want this one to start I'm going to zoom in a little bit because I can actually move this further back to the beginning okay okay let's go back okay yeah good now I'm going to trim off the little bit here because I don't need it and I'm going to move this right back to the beginning oh we've done it oh, awesome okay Let's hear it. I don't know who you are. Good. And I don't need this bit at the end, so let's just be tidy about it and cut off what I don't need. It's just going to give me more room to move things. But I don't like where this comes in. And this is why I want to think musically, because I can hear very clearly the beat in this piece. So it's one, I don't know who two, you are. three, four. One, two, three, four. I don't know four. what you want. And this is my sort of end of my first two bars is this beat here. So what I want, actually want to have happen is this one to repeat after two bars. So I'm going to bring this forward and actually trim off some stuff at the end again because I want this, highlight this bit, copy. In fact, let's do this make my life easier. I'm going to move this back again. So what I'm looking at is for this end of this line here to be in line with this beginning of the new bar. Then I'm going to highlight all of this bit here. I'm just going to take a guess to see if it works because obviously with it being a computer software, if it doesn't work, I can just do it again. That's the beauty of it. And paste it there and it goes along. Now I can just actually, if I wanted to keep doing this, paste and paste. And that's my four bars. So let's see if that's going to work over the eight bars. Let's have I don't know who you are. One, two, three. I don't know what you want. I don't, I don't know, know who you are. are. One, two, three. I don't know what you want. I don't know who you are. I don't know what you want. I don't know who you are. I don't know what you want. Cool. And so that takes me up to the end of that first section. I'm actually going to get rid of this just to make the ending um, different to the rest of it and that's kind of it I mean remember when you've got yours you're gonna see these as boxes and so the lines at the beginning of each box is gonna be really important for queuing up where you're gonna get the sound to be because what you don't want is these vocal samples to have nothing to do with the music here it's really got to line up so visually you've got these visual cues as well as the best tool when you're doing this which is of course your ears if it sounds good then it is good. That's a general rule when you're working with music. So let's have a listen for this next section here. I want to change and find another sample and do something else with it. So I don't know what you want. No. Money. I don't know what you want. Money. Yeah, okay, cool. Gonna use that actually. So I don't know what you want is gonna come right at the beginning of this new section. And I can just click here to preview, and then I'm going to move money. So I'm going to use money and skills. I'm going to make a sum piece. I don't know what you want. Money, skills. Let's have a listen from here. I don't know what you want. Money. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm not sure I like where this is, so I'm going to move it forward a little bit. But again, all I'm doing at the moment is just guessing. And then I'm going to listen, and if it sounds musical and in the right place, then I'm going to take a stab at just copying and pasting it along. So let's see. This one is a little harder, actually, to see, because I've this is the version that I um, uh, saved as the audio, so it doesn't have my little lines in, which is a little harder. So I'm going to have to trust my ears more. I don't know what you want. One, two, Money. four, one, Skills. two three four and so this is where I want us to cut actually that that works great so I'm gonna this is my line here for the new section so highlight the bit that I've got um, copy that move it along let's paste it and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna move it into place because I need to really listen I don't know what you want to money skills I don't know what you want it's too it's in too early so it's just trying to hear I don't know what you want money I think I can move this as well so it's thinking musically about it right here we go I don't know what you want money skills it's just not in the right place is it I don't know what you want one two money, money two skills two three skills if I can sing it, then I'm going to try and make it right. So I don't know what you want. Money. Skills. I don't know what you want. Money. Skills. Something like that. That's what I'm going for. So I don't know what you want. One, two, Money. Skills. Four, I don't know what you want. Money. So this is now rubbish and I don't like it. So... I'm going to get rid of it because I like where this is, but what I've actually got is that beat one happening halfway through here. But I like the placement of that money and skills now. So as long as I get the right paste point, again, I'm moving left and right. It's a lot of little like fine work in here, but once I get it right, what you want. money, skills. I don't know what you want. Money. It's too early. Don't know what you want is the one, so I think about there's probably gonna work. I don't know what you want. Money. Skills. I don't know what you want. It's gonna have to come back a bit. Copy that. Let's just speed this up. I'm just gonna take a guess. Boom, paste it there. Boom, paste it there, and then at the end we're going to start with what I liked about the one that I did before is that when the beat comes in we get that thing in kind of dance music where we kind of call it like a drop uh, so what I can do now is d doesn't really matter where this is for now I can come back in and fix that but for speed we want this is the main sample and I will kill you and I will kill you so let's quickly do this bit now copy let's move this back where am I trying to be so I'm going to paste this here. So I know that for sure, no matter what's happening in this section, I'm going to get the bit that I want, which is, I will kill you, and then the beat's going to come back in. That's probably going to work. So let's just have a listen how wrong I've got this and see if we can tidy it up. I don't know what you want. Money. Skills. Skills. Two, three, four. I don't know what you want. One, two, Money. Skills. Skills. Four. I don't know what you want. Money. Skills. Skills. I don't know what you want. I don't know what you want. So you can see how these have all got out of place here. So, I mean, really, I'm sort of trying to hear it in my head where I want these things to go. This is way too late. So I'm going to move this forward. Move this forward again. For you, it will be much easier. You will see these vertical lines so you can see exactly where it's going to fit. Let's go one more time. And then we're going to hear it at the end. We're going to get the... I don't know what you want. I don't know what you want. Money. And I will kill you. Cool. And then uh, if I want to be uh, really easy about it, I can just take, again, all of that stuff I've done at the beginning, all of that copying there, and I can paste it along at the back here. Um, 
a really important thing to look at as well. Let's see if I can find this in preferences. This is going to be uh, important here. If you go into tracks and you come down, uh, move, editing a clip can move other clips. You want that not to be ticked. So editing a clip can move other clips. That needs to be unclicked. So it's in preferences, tracks, and this. The reason is that uh, if I then go back and I want to move this back into a bit here, what's unfortunately nudges all the rest of the stuff forward, which I don't want. So uh, that's really how we're editing it. Now I can go in and have more fun with this by um, kill you, and I can then re repeat these little bits much, much quicker. That gives me a whole other kind of effect as well. Uh, and effects we're going to look at in the next lesson. So really, your task this lesson is just to try to extract some of these audio bits and just put it together. I don't know who you are. And see if you can move it around. I don't know what you want. I don't know who you are. And use your little grid at the top to help you and try to fit everything in line and I just get it are. musical, right? Get it in time with the beat and you'll you be uh, you'll be I up and running. Okay, great. That's lesson two. Good luck, folks.